Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I'd like to chat to you about shooting in the most amazing location up to date. It's just me. First, I'd like to mention this video is sponsored by Squarespace. They're an awesome all-in-one platform for all that your website might need. They have a great customer service in case you have any issues with setting up your website. They have beautiful templates that you can fully customize and you can change around if you change your mind at some stage. They are very affordable to work with. Their plans start at around $10 a month, which is really, really good, especially if you're just starting out and you don't have a lot of money to put into your website. It looks super professional, super nice, and I definitely recommend it. So if you guys want to check it out, make sure to use my discount code and you'll get 10% off of your first purchase. So today I'd like to take you with me on the most magical um, journey that I had to experience yet as a photographer. I shot in this really awesome location um, in the middle of nowhere next to this beautiful river flowing and it was just the most serene and beautiful experience. And I just want to tell you a bit about how it came about and how I made it happen. So when I was planning my Bali trip, I really wanted to take some time off and just relax for a few days. I've been really overworking myself and it's been showing in my anxiety. So I decided to take a few days off. I found this really amazing place in the middle of nowhere by the volcano that is now inactive, so it's okay to go there. And I booked it in on Airbnb. Um, but, you know, being myself, I was thinking that, oh, what if I get a model there for one day just to take some photos and then the rest of the time I just relax. So this is what I did. I messaged my friend who I shot with before and I was like, you know what, um, is there any chance you feel like going there? It's a bit of a drive. It's around two hours away from where we're usually staying, but it's a really beautiful place. And would you be up for joining me and taking some photos there? Luckily for me, it turns out that this place was on my model's you know, to-go list. So she said, I don't care how far I need to go. I will just go there and I will see you there on Friday. And Courtney has her own brand. So I decided that, you know, maybe we can incorporate some of her own looks in there and um, I didn't really mind doing that because she was doing us a nice favor by coming there and taking photos with us so I said why won't we just have half swimmer and half of your own resort kind of work usually if I organize shoots like that that uh, uh, require a bit more prep and maybe you know the, the road is a bit longer to get to and so on I usually go for people that I worked with already and that I trust and that I know that are going to do great because you know um, we ended up having her stay over at our place and um, for the night there was an extra bedroom there and it was just nice and easy because we get along we know that we like each other there was no awkwardness so it was just nice and relaxed so we took the photos and then we took some more photos the following morning just because we didn't get a chance um, to shoot some of the stuff because we ran out of light we arrived at around three o'clock in the afternoon so we started taking some photos around probably 3 30 to 4 o'clock um, the light was still quite harsh um, so we kind of had to find places that worked um, I went for a lot of backlit stuff outside by the pool because the light was kind of getting lower and was kind of falling from behind so I thought it would look really really nice. Because Courtney's brand is mainly linen, the clothes are very light and breathable and because we were shooting backlit you could see her lovely silhouette underneath the clothes which I thought was really really nice. It created really really nice moody shots that I loved. Once the sun got a bit lower we went upstairs and we shot some swimwear. I had swimmer from from a brand that lent it to me and um, I decided to go for this golden tone because I thought that with the light and with the bamboo structure it would really um, work for the color scheme that I was working with so everything was just a very nice and warm and golden and I just thought it looked really really lovely so usually if you stay in places like that that you actually paid for yourself to stay at 95% um, of the time they never have a problem with you taking photos there um, you know unless it's a commercial job or it's something that's obscene or you know something that is inappropriate and then they might have issues with it but if you create beautiful photos and you give them content to tag and you know to post and so on then um, it's usually very very easy to just do that and you know that's why I thought it would be nice to just kind of get um, the model there and just shoot while we're staying there anyway um, so it's definitely worth trying also another thing that you can try is sometimes ask 
those kind of places if they would let you shoot in between maybe you know people changing from one place to the other so let's say the checkout time is at 11 and the check-in time is at 3 so maybe they would let you shoot in a location between let's say 11 and 1 or something some of uh, the places do that I've spoken to so it's always a good way to kind of avoid having to pay if you don't want to stay at the place and still get the benefit of shooting um, in that location okay everyone that's it for today i hope you enjoyed this video if you want to check anybody out the location the clothing the model um, i put all the links down below make sure to check them out and check out my instagram and follow me if you haven't already and if you did like this video please give it a thumbs up please subscribe to my channel and i'll see you next time